since my last attempt failed to fly from up the mountains over there and land uh, the Phantom over here eight kilometers away uh, I want to do a test because I want to try it again um, but I want to make sure uh, what the behavior is of the Phantom as you can see there is a uh, this red building over there but right from here and you can see it with this camera I have a look on a little white building uphill over there and I want to fly to this white building and probably land on top of it but when I fly over there I want to make sure that uh, the battery is so low that uh, it does not have enough to return to home and then I'm hoovering uh, above or near that building over there and then I want to lose signal so I can do this by just lowering my transmitter or just walking a little bit uh, to, to the left here because there's this big red building in between and I will definitely lose uh, signal and then I want to know what it's doing uh, it does not have enough battery to return to home will it still try to get as far as possible or will it just hoover over there and wait and do nothing until the battery runs out and then it will land over there on that building so it's an experiment let's see how it's going oh and by the way i have set up this camera over here and probably you might even see the phantom flying there so okay let's let's do it everything is okay i have uh, 65 percent battery that's uh, on purpose because i don't want to have to wait very long before the battery is so low it cannot return to home anymore so um all systems up i think i'm ready to go so i'm flying away from my position not to draw too much attention and i'm gonna take over on the goggles very nice view like this Cancel. All right. Cancel. Come on, cancel. All right. That took a long time to cancel uh, this, but this. All right. So we, meanwhile, we passed uh, the pink building, and now I'm heading straight. Actually, this is very good. I'm heading straight to the white building. So my battery is already so low that uh, the DJI app is thinking it cannot return home. So that's good because that's what we wanted. Now I arrived at the white building. Let's have a good look this position. I can land on the roof. I think it's the safest to land on the roof. So let's turn the camera completely down. Um, that was up a little bit. And I think I can climb up there without a problem. Let's, let's see 
I go down a little bit. I will have a look on the. Um, it says eight meters. So now, over here, it's like the sensors say it's five meters. Six meters. I want to go to five meters above uh, the roof. Four meters. So I should be able to see this in the camera now. Yeah, you can definitely see the phantom hanging out there. Now I want to lose signal. So I'm going over here. I'm losing signal. It says no signal. All right. Now, what is it doing? What is it doing? I have to wait three seconds. This is at least three seconds. And now I want to have a look again. It's still out there. All right. Which is basically good. Okay. It's good. It will not. Now what I'm going to do. I'm gonna land on the roof. Shall we try to lose signal once more just to be sure? Okay, one more time. And just wait out here, lose signal. Wait a couple of seconds. Basically, this is good. It just hangs out there and it will not try to return home because it means if I lose signal. I, I just have to go up, get my signal back, choose the right position, and have it uh, land over there. It does want to, to go home. Oh, my goodness. Stop going home. Stupid thing. All right, camera up, because I don't have enough battery to go home. Camera up, wow. Go over there again. I know the battery is low. Looks like I lost signal again because it's on the roof now. But I think it landed. I will wait till, until I get the signal back in case it just started to um, go up again. But I think it just landed on the roof. All right, so I, I'm not getting the signal back. And that means I'm going to get my car and drive up there and get it back. So, see you over there. From here it's really difficult to see which house it is. No, it must be over there. That one over there. But how do I get there? I can see it from here. I'll show you. Look, it's over there. This house would have been easier, but I had to pick the last one. Wow. How do I get there? I think I'm gonna take the road. All right. If it would have flown back, it might even have landed somewhere over here. Impossible to retrieve. Oh, what did I do? Oh, it's over there. Oh, 
I think I might get up here and then like this, like this, and like this, and then like this, and like this. Okay, not too difficult, but this was a shortcut. All right, I'm at the house. Ah, it's on the roof over here. If it's all right and the camera is still running, you should be able to see me. One, two. If I fall down, at least we will have some good footage of it. It's still on. It doesn't use a lot of battery when it's just standing out there. Yep. <clears throat> ah, okay, I'm here. You can come now, you too. Now, the question is, what's the normal route back? There's literally no road whatsoever leading to this house. Ah. Oh. Phew. oh my word. I got the drone back, but I'm not happy with the result of my test because even when the battery is so low that it cannot safely return home anymore, it will still try to do this when uh, the signal is lost. It will just try to get as close to home as possible. It does make sense, of course, in, in, in most of the situations, but in my case, I'm not happy with it because I don't want it to return home. I want it to get as close as possible to where I want to land it. Anyway. I hope you like my adventures. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel to see more and you can give me any comment. So see you on the next episode. After making this video, I discovered that there is an option in the menu of the DJI Go app where you can set the behavior of when, when it loses signal. You can find that over here, go to menu, go to MC settings, then advanced settings, and there you find RC lo signal lost. And what you can do is, on default it's uh, return to home, and there are two more options, throttle down and hoover. For me, in my situation, it would be best to initially have it on return to home because when I would lose signal, it would try to return to home and then ascend and try to come back and at one point you get the signal back and after you try that uh, like two or three times and you find out, okay, it's not working, uh, then I could decide like I, I w I'm going to find a landing spot and I'm going to select throttle down because if I try to land and in the process I lose signal with the throttle down, it will continue to land instead of again trying to return to home. Hmm. Good option, good thinking of DJI that they made this available.